today's star time guests, plural, just like your ears, rabbit ears, happens to be Sherlock Holmes and Dr. Watkins. <laughs> Me, A little bit too much wax in there. You'll have to cut out those carrots. You'll never fit in my hat. Boys and girls, it is our proud pleasure to present Sherlock Holmes and Dr. Watkins. The case is solved. He's the culprit. Amazing, Dome. How did you know that? Well, I'm glad you asked. Now, what is a common slang term for money? Hey, be a dick. Sounds like it. Lettuce! Who would steal lettuce? Why, of course, Holmes, a rabbit! He's the one who stole your money. But nobody stole any money from me. Case is solved. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you, Thank you. Gentlemen, you have had great success involving mysteries with ghosts. Could you find a ghost for me? Why? Did, Did you, you lose one? <laughs> no, but I have a feeling you boys lost something. You're marvel. Oh, nonsense. I have him right here. Would you uh, care to shoot around? Hurt! Hurt, I say. Shall we proceed with this so-called show? Dome's is the ghost. Uh, it's Balderdash, Watkins. Oh, sorry, Balderdash. The name is Peter Bottom Bumpkin. Watkins! Bumpkin! So... I happen to be the director. I think the gentlemen in the white coats are looking for you, too. I'll tell them you're here. Good. And tell them I'll have a vanilla fudge on a stick. I would like a pistachio on a cone. Oh, nuts! <laughs> no, no, we like fruit. Nuts get in the cone. Are good, but nuts. Oh, I have a feeling that my show is turning into a crime. Then you confess. Watkins, place this man under arrest. Why are you letting him take you away? Oh, why? Because I'll be safe in jail from the ghost of Zingo. You're uncanny, Domes. Where did you learn such things? School. What school? Elementary, my dear Watkins. <laughs> Elementary. Isn't he amazing? Absolutely, Absolutely amazing. amazing. <laughs>